Patrick with Say Cheese Photo Booths. Happy to show you this video today because I'm at one of my very favorite venues. We're talking top five for me personally in the city. And that is the Carriage House. So we're directly behind the main Manor House campus. This is a newer building. It might be five years old or less. Um, this is my, like if I have a house, this is my styling right here. <laughs> Start with the great landscaping, it's July, so everything's in bloom, of course. Um, for today's event, wedding, uh, you can see that they have this courtyard space, this big patio space being used for the ceremony. Okay, so maybe that'll work for you and your event. I just, oh my gosh, I just, I love architecture, I like construction, and here you've got some slate um, stonework, just beautiful, leading up to the main entrance there. We're going to sneak on over here to this side entrance, and walk in, but I, I just love the architecture, it's, it's creative, it's a mixture of different elements, just Ah, I wish this was my house. I love it here. Beautiful, beautiful. Let's take a look inside, shall we? All right, so let's go up into the main space here. This is a smaller venue, so you're not going to get these huge weddings here, but if you're looking for a more intimate gathering space, this is a home run. So this is about how many tables you can get into here. All right. You're looking at it, great focal point with the fireplace. Love the stone, the big mantle, fire you can go in there. Great for fall, winter, maybe even spring, early spring. And let's pan up to the ceiling. One of my very favorite features is all of the white beadboard contrasting with those joists, those uh, beams. Those lanterns all hanging down, pendant style. Man, oh man, beautiful flooring, yes, yes, and even those stone columns dressing up the side walls on both sides. Buffet is set up back there, as you can see. Also a nice stained glass feature right there, you gotta love that. Lots of dark wood contrasting with the light walls. Here you have a cake for today, simple and elegant. And then we'll take you down to this other room right here where the photo is at, give you some visualization of what that looks like. Because typically when we have a booth here, we're set up in this room. Now this is where a lot of the dancing will take place tonight. Another fireplace. Gotta point this out, this is amazing. I've never seen this in 11 years of running photo booths. So the bride is a, uh, I believe she's a radiologist and they were able to capture the visual representation of saying I do. I, know, I don't know who is who with purple and white there, but I've never seen that. That is brilliant, very cool. Heck, you could probably offer that as a service. If you have some kind of machine that captures that data, you could sell that as a service. A little business idea there. All right, so this is a uh, package three rental. So they're going to get prop. Props are standard with every rental, right? And they're a mix of wearable items, hats, glasses, and then your stick props right here. Da -da -da. Okay, this separate printer right here, this is uh, what we use for snap and print. So your cell phone pictures get printed from that separate printer there. There's also a printer of course inside the photo booth. We are making a scrapbook as you can see there. Typically our scrapbooks are black or silver. And then this is the big cheese. So it is a stand-up enclosure. It's going to fit four to six people, right? It'll fit in with any kind of decor. And that's why it was designed as such. So it'll complement, not be an eyesore. Uh, out of that booth is going to come up to six prints per session. And there you have it, guys. I hope this is helpful. One last look at this room. This place is awesome, amazing carriage house. Again, it's right behind the manor house, the main campus, here in Mason, Ohio.
Hope you find this enjoyable and helpful. Thanks.